hi friends today i'm gonna show you how to do your tut online application yeah so no. you can search tut yes and you click on this website here yeah. then you click apply now so here they are banking details here you can check the details here for application fee the reference is your identity number and make sure that you have your identity document your sinner certificate and all other relevant documents as to already have a student number you can click no if you don't have a student number then returning to complete an application if you are returning to complete an application you can click yes but if not you can click no then you can click accept here and click next then okay let's begin the application process so here guys you must provide all your personal details and and make sure that you complete all the fields that are indicated with the red star uh, because they are composite this one you cannot skip this one other fields here you can see there is no star like this one median name you can leave that one all right are you a, a citizen a position of a valid SAID yes then i'll provide my id number right now so make sure that you organize all your details here yeah? your details and your next skin details will be required as well make sure that you have all the details the email address before you begin your application process okay now citizenship code i'll click here mm, i'll click here yeah then gender it's a female and then date of birth all right you just search here the date of birth mm. this one is 2002 yeah okay we are here on title so it's miss so if you are married misses but this one can click miss initials is the first letter of your name if you have two names the first two letters of your names uh, this one is is zp right yeah zp okay this one is is singing this one is singing and uh okay home language this one is from pumala so uh, yeah okay ethnic group it's a uh, it's in africa we are black brothers and sisters are you if you are colored please don't mind yeah if you are in the bell and the bell yeah should i select swat on or african yeah okay i will select swat let me be specific because i'm south african i think the one is to select african maybe it's foreigners yeah swat yeah are you employed no unemployed no Okay, where did you hear about us? I'll just say to the website, yeah. A buzzer required, yes, I need buzzer and it's fast. Or funza rushaga. Okay, your address here. Yeah. We use the number this side where I'm from, so I'll type my ten number here. Yeah. You maybe use uh, I don't know, use a street name or street number or house number. Okay, you'll write yours towns commerce depot then provinces pumala postal code uh, make sure that you provide yours as well so that you can get your place right so if you have a postal address you can click here if not you can just proceed i have a postal address just put my post here pure box okay zero do one residence guys on campus is nice nice 
Ah, but uh, but even off campus, yeah. So I don't want to discourage. I mean, I don't, I don't want to discourage you. Like it depends who you are. Yeah, but for me, I prefer off campus because off campus is peaceful, guys. Yeah. On campus is busy, hey, Joe. It's like a mall, you see, a mall. Yeah, a lot of things are happening there, so. Okay, on, do you want to apply for residence? Yes, hey, I took too much. Yes, I do, okay. Uh, please indicate whether you have a disability. No, I don't have. You click here, and then you click research here, yeah, and choose. Your condition, yeah, but for me it's nine. No, it's none. Yeah. Okay, next. Okay, next of kin names. Yeah, names. Okay. I will hide the number here. Yeah. On cellular phone number, you can repeat the same number. Yeah. Uh, on work number, I don't have a work number. And address, you can provide the previous address. Yeah, but if it's different, uh, you can provide a different address. Yeah. yeah, email address of your mom or father. You can repeat here also. Put the email address for your brother, your sister, your cousin. Any email address that you have. You can put anyone else here. Yeah. So it will be accountable. Maybe if they don't find your your mother. Yeah, you can repeat the details of your mom if it's the one who's accountable. Or your father or your brother or your friend. Someone who will stand in the gap if they don't find you. Yeah. A number here and again on home phone number. Or if you have a different cell phone number, you can put, put an address, yeah? email address. Next page. This girl completed metric last year, 2023. So now she's applying for 2024. And applications, they are already open. And for those who want to make, uh, to apply for new courses. <laughs> and for those who want to change courses or want to add courses. Yeah. You are free to do that. And so if you are doing metric, your results will not appear here. So you'll be required to provide your final grade 11 results and the cope of your report with the school stamp or certified. Yeah, then you, then you also record the percentages and the symbols here. So don't be intimidated with your grade 11 results. Yeah, just apply and make sure that you do well on your exam so that you can improve your results. Metric or grade 12 year. Okay, 2023. Are you applying for undergraduate or postgraduate? Okay, if you want to do advanced or honors or you're continuing with your studies. Yeah. They will be postgraduate, but here, yeah, since you are first time applicant, uh, yeah, since your results came last year, obviously you are undergraduate. They've just selected an undergraduate for you. Don't need to do anything here. Yeah? Just proceed here. Yeah? Are you upgrading? If you are upgrading, you'll say yes. If not, click no. Okay, next to the next page. Okay, the school where you did your high school. Okay, yeah, Mithabov Secondary School. Uh, what are you currently doing? Unemployed. I'll click other. Have you started another institution? If yes, and click yes. If no, just click no. If yes, you need to provide the details. You'll be asked some of the details. You'll see that. Let me click uh, academic year is 2025, right? 2024, why? Here are the faculties you can choose from. I think I fit on humanities. Let me try humanities. 
Let me check this one. I am on the programs here. Yeah. Let me start here. I want to screenshot now. I want to screenshot. Yeah. Okay. Let me move here. Yeah. I'm just showing you guys this is the list of all the available programs okay now we are moving to humanist okay humanist you can see humanist here yeah. this screenshot okay let's move to information from programs you can choose from okay let's close move to the last uh, management science yeah okay let me go back to humanism and make one selection then now i'll just choose a diploma in public affairs mm -hmm. yeah search this semester Bombay, since I'm at Pumalang, okay, I'll click add qualification. I've added, so I will not continue. I want to just to have time and go through the program list or prospect charts and, and check the minimum requirements there before I can proceed with other applications or with other choices because now I'll. I'll click next for now but if you already checked everything in the minimum requirements and you know the programs that you are looking for you can make your selection up to I think up to five yeah okay I'll click continue yeah. okay you have to create your own pin in here let me read the instruction just read the instruction here yeah. Is five digit pin do not start with a zero i'm tired now i have to end this video now so i'll make another video and show you other things that i think you need after watching this video okay now just create just a pin here make sure that you don't repeat digits for instance, maybe you repeat, you say 880. Let me create mine here. Then you click I accept. Then here, he, the submit application is blank. And tick here. Then you tick again. Then it will be bold. Now submit application is active. You know, it's ready. Okay, you can click submit application we are done so you can check here the documents which are required and uh, the steps how to upload and everything you can read everything here but before you close you have to get your student number here don't forget your student number here don't make that mistake Okay, do you have an electronic documents? If you don't now, even if you can say yes, even if you can lie, that doesn't matter here. But if you don't have, you can click no. Even if you can lie, let me lie. <laughs> yes, I have. You you will get your student now. Okay, nothing is showing here. There is no next, there is nothing. Repeat the repeat the process do you have an LT copy click here you click here and you click yes you see next is here now then you click next so these documents that are listed here are compulsory if you don't provide these documents all these documents your application will not be processed if you are doing metric you have to provide grade 11 results 
make sure that you do that you identity document and your application fee without an application fee it's a waste of time just provide all the required documents yeah if you don't have your report or you lost it go to school and to your principals they will print it for you yeah okay then you can click complete you can screenshot this information mm. then you can load your documents here if you don't have your documents then you have because now you 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 receive a student number and you you get your password i think uh, on your email yeah you log in then you go to certificate send and you upload your documents later okay click complete upload to get your student number okay guys this is what i wanted to show you and i hope you enjoyed this video and if there's anything that you don't understand you need clarity on i can assist you and i will appreciate if you subscribe to my youtube channel you can text me for more information on whatsapp you can check my number on my youtube channel description okay and make sure that your reference when you are paying you can pay even using your phone your keep it up app any net bank app, app just make sure that your reference is your identity number not your student number don't make that mistake yeah make sure okay guys bye 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 bye, bye. 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 see ya see ya bye see you guys later